Hello, Sophia here. Today I'm going to make a couple of cards for you. Winter cards, that is. And I'm using the Echo Park 6x6 paper pad called Snowed In. It's got some really beautiful um, papers in here. I've taken some out so far, what I want to use. Um, I also purchased the Echo Park, um, I don't know, it's Snowed In. I guess these are sentiments, I'm not really sure, some kind of cards. Um, I'm going to actually cut them and I'm going to use some of them as a sentiment on the cards that I make. So let's get started. Okay, so the first card I'm going to do, I took this little card called Warm and Cozy. And I'm going to um, use these two pattern papers with it. Now I know it does have, it has a little bit of pattern paper in here from another one, but they all mix and match. So we should still be good. Okay, so the first thing that I want to do is I'm going to cut a mat from this paper. No, actually, I want to cut a mat from here first. And then put it on here. Okay, so let's just get my trimmer here. Okay, I'll glue this down. take this paper and I think I'm going to use it on the whole card. Yeah, I'm going to do it at four and a quarter. Four and a quarter by five and a half. Okay, now these, all these little scraps, I'm going to hang on to them. Okay, now what I want to do is I want to take a bigger, I want to take a bigger border in this. Or do I want to go this way? I'll go the, the long way, just in case I want to use the bigger piece for something. The way my light's shining, I couldn't really tell where I was on my card. Okay. All right, so that's that. This. Now, um, I'm just wondering if I need to do another... I need to do another black mat. Probably not. That looks kind of cool, actually, with the white. But I'm going to grab some black. Just put it on here. Oh, wow. See, now it really pops out. Yeah. Okay, so I wonder if I could put... I was going to put maybe a ribbon on it. Like maybe some... Like wrap around with a... I'm not sure how that's going to look. Especially with the, oh, maybe if I put it over there and I do it this way. Let's try that. I kind of like that. All right. Okay, let's just snip it. Great. then my card can come here. Yay. Okay, I'm going to glue that down. Okay. I am going to glue this down now. It's so thick now because of all the matting I did, but hey, I don't care. That's okay with me. Okay, 
Yeah, getting back to the temperature, it's actually been really, I live in northern Manitoba in Canada, and it, the temperature's actually been really lovely, but overnight it gets chilly, so I noticed the wind chill last night was minus 26, and I thought, eh, I think I'll just stay in for the night. <laughs> down make sure it stays and I'm gonna cut another little piece of ribbon and all I want to do okay, I am just going to oh maybe I didn't cut it big enough I'm just going to whoops come back here <laughs> this is painful to watch isn't it Okay, there we go. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut it a little bit like that and like this. Okay, and I'm going to take a glue dot. Excuse my arm there. I'm going to take a glue dot now. I've already got it down, so I'm going to take the glue dot off with my fingers because my pokey tool disappeared i have no idea where it is but i do have another one i purchased another one and it is on the way okay there we go so that's going to hold my ribbon down finally no actually you know what i don't have any bling on here i don't have any any um sparkle things so i gotta put a little bit of bling on here and i think i might do some <laughs> let's do the no, I'm not sure. It's not really bling. These aren't, but um, that's okay. So what do you want to do on here? I think these dark ones would look nice. Just a one and a two and a three. There. Sorry, that one looks quite cute. Okay, so number two. Um, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to cut this paper down to the size of my uh, card. So four and a quarter by five and one half. I'm going to <clears throat> I'm just gonna get rid of some of this stuff. Okay, now what I want to do that I always like to do is cut the center out so I can use it for something else. I'm just gonna move my trimmer. <clears throat> Excuse me. Put my cuddle bug in place. And let's roll. Excuse me, I have a frog in my throat today. Okay, so I'm just going to use this a little bit later probably. We'll see. Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to put this on my card base. Okay, I'm just going to glue it. Should we line it up with the fold because we can't cut the fold 
if we need to later we won't be able to so if your card is not lining up properly then there we go all right perfect okay now what i want to do is i want to cut this paper i want it to fit inside this frame i don't think i'm going to put it over the frame i think i'm going to put it inside the frame so we have a nice big uh, wood border on here okay so let's see how much i need okay i'm going to cut this top off first because it has that hole in there so i can grab my trimmer again <clears throat> Go. Okay, okay, now I'm going to just line this up with the inside here. Oops, I guess we got to do it this way. Okay, and I'm just going to cut it right here so it fits in and move it down so I can see this side. And I'm going to cut it right here. Okay. And it's down here. Okay, does that fit in there? Yes, it fits in there nicely. <clears throat> Make sure it's right side up. <laughs> And I'm just going to glue it inside. All right, now it's all inside there. It looks kind of cool. Okay, now this, now this is way too big to go on there. So let's play with this. All right, here we go. Flying by the seat of my pants here, gals and guys. Okay, so I'm going to trim this bundle up. I'm going to cut the bundle up off and oops, and I think I'm going to use that as my sentiment on here. And I'm just going to trim it a bit because I think I want to maybe mat it a bit. Go on here. It, does, it kind of just doesn't stand out there, right? <clears throat> now this part. Oh! You, uh, you guys know what I'm going to do, right? Fussy cut. I love fussy cutting. Okay. So let's get... brown too. I think that might look cool. Ooh, that's kind of small, but that's okay. It'll still work. Awesome. Okay, what I'm going to do is, where's my card panel here? I'm going to cut out this little sweater. Okay, so I'm thinking it would go on here. Just move this out of the way. This would go on here. It's kind of up here. Hmm. I got, wait a second, I got another idea. Um, I'm going to cut this piece. <clears throat> Put my cutter away, bring my cutter back. I should just leave it in place, shouldn't I? <laughs> Okay, let's see. I'm just going to try something. It may not work, but it might work. You just never know. Okay, so I cut two 
one quarter inch pieces. And I want to see if I can make a ski. Kind of like what they have in here. I'm not sure how the tops are cut, but I'm gonna find out. <laughs> Okay, so what I'm thinking, on here they're all crossed. Um, if I cross it, I need to cut these probably. Oh, look, I can turn these so they're like up like skis. Huh, cool, how cool is that? Okay, and I'll cross them up further. I think, put this down, put this down. Alrighty. Okay, so I can cut. Let me make them closer. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Have patience. <laughs> okay, so bring this one up a little bit. Okay, so I can cut this bottom part off. All right. Now, while I have it there, <laughs> I'm going to try to add some glue to this, to these little ends. Oops. Let's change on this one first. There we go. Okay. Now I don't want them to move, so I am going to stick a little bit of glue underneath where they join. Okay. Oops. And underneath. Down. I'm not going to do it all the way to the end because I do like that they stick up a little bit here. It looks kind of cool. Oh, I probably should have done them wider apart. Too late now. Okay. Okay. Sometimes it's hard to tell if it's straight or not okay so now my little uh, sweater guy here I think I'm gonna lift him up on some foam adhesive I'm getting anxious to see how this is gonna turn out now okay so I can overlap it a little bit there and there, there we go. Oh my goodness, this turned out so cute. I love, love, love the little skis on there. Perfect. So there you have it, the second card. I'm just gonna clear off my space here. And here's the first card, the warm and cozy. It turned out really cute with the ribbon and the black trim. And it looks really sharp. And this one, of course, I had to cut it up, but I think it worked out just fine, don't you? I like the little... I really like these little skis on here and the little shirt. Anyways, I hope you like this video. You have an awesome day and we'll talk soon. Bye for now.